Sailor Senshi, my name is Sailor Snubs. Welcome to my YouTube channel all about Sailor Moon news, merch reviews, and how-tos. My birthday just happened about a week ago, a week and a half ago, and I got a few Sailor Moon things, so today I just wanted to show you a very small Sailor Moon haul from my birthday. Now one of these items was a surprise, another one was on my wish list, I guess you would say, and then another one I got was just a gift to me because I knew that it was a little too expensive for anyone else to purchase for me as a gift. So that last one was just something that I've wanted for a very long time. I'll keep that one until the end. You will see it soon enough. But first, the first one that I received, you have probably already noticed on me, it's this necklace. So this is from Sapphire Studios, which is a company down in Australia who specializes in a very, very pretty and really sparkly and kind of big uh, jewelry. They do gold, they do sterling silver as well as platinum. Uh, this crescent moon moon stick necklace is specifically the sterling silver version with rose gold cherry blossoms on it and it also has some lab created crystals on it as well. This is a beautiful piece that I would recommend to anyone who is a Sailor Moon fan because honestly it's a lot prettier than some of the licensed jewelry straight from Japan so I really like how Sapphire Studios designed this piece. It's really heavy you can tell how durable it is and it feels really good to wear just because it's it's like, it's big, but it's not gaudy and it's very intricate. It's very detailed. I love the sparkle. I've gotten a ton of compliments on it ever since I got it. So this was my gift from my husband and it was the thing that was on my wish list. Also, Sapphire Studios is hecka fancy and they sent it in this very fancy, really big box. It says Sapphire Studios at the top and it's got plenty of room. So I kept the box because I was just like, these are one of the boxes that you see in those like fancy princess movies where the guy's just like, look at these diamonds. And then he opens the necklace box and then the princess sees it and she's like wow that's amazing so for me this is my like princess jewelry box and i feel like i'll keep it in here uh if i wasn't lazy but i'm lazy so i just like wear the thing constantly and never take it off by the way since you can currently get the sapphire studios moonstick ne necklace as well as a few other items from their store that have to do with sailor moon i'll put the link down below as well as the pricing so that you know how much it would cost to purchase one the next item is from my imaginary best friend, and this was a complete surprise, and I was slightly drunk when I opened it, so I don't know if I expressed how excited I was. We were at a karaoke bar, we were singing things, and I was opening packages and trying not to get sparkles everywhere in the karaoke room because we didn't want to get charged for sparkles. So, this is what I got from her. It is a gorgeous, I believe this is from Society6? Yeah, it's from Society6. Uh, this is a beautiful, beautiful, I think it's a f Sherpa blanket. It's probably made out of polyester. Yeah, it's 100% polyester, but it has this beautiful art print on the front. And it's huge. It's taller than I am. So this is such good timing, too, because we're going into winter, so it's getting cold. But I just love the art on here. It's just so classic Sailor Moon. It's Usagi. She's laying down on her bed in her bedroom. And then Luna is located right next to her. And she's got stuff all over the bed. And everything on the bed has something to do with Sailor Moon. There's donuts up in the corner. There's books like manga. And there's magazines that she probably reads all the time instead of studying because, you know, it's Sailor Moon. She's got snacks, a half-eaten sandwich. Uh, this is really cute. It says Sailor Moon saves the day and it's a little newspaper. Oh, that's so adorable. I love it. And then at the bottom she's got her laptop, her school bag. What else can you see on here? It's a very big blanket. Oh, and then you can see your nightstand over in the corner and a smartphone. I think that's a smartphone. But I love that she's playing video games. At least I think it's that I, I think it looks like Usagi's playing video games on a DS and a Nintendo. That's really cute. So the artist that made this, her name is Jacqueline de Leon, and she's on Instagram as well as obviously Society6, but she has an online store if you're interested in her work. She doesn't just do Sailor Moon. This is one of the only art uh, things that she's done of Sailor Moon, but she also does a whole bunch of us other trendy things like she recently did a Sabrina drawing That's really pretty so I definitely re recommend following her on Instagram and checking out her work because this is beautiful And she has a bunch of prints for sale and stuff. So I really like her work a lot 
Okay, and the last item is the item that I've been coveting for a very, very long time, but I knew that it was just going to continue to go up in price, so I decided to go ahead and bite that bullet and purchase it myself with a gift card that my mom gave me for Amazon. So I got it. <laughs> it's the Kaleida Moonscope Proplica. It's huge. It's gigantic. Is it upside down? Oh, it is upside down. Sorry guys. There you go. It's the Kaleida Moonscope Proplica and it's amazing. This is the international version. You can tell because it's got the little choking hazard sticker on it, but it also has the Toei sticker on it as well. I'm going to open this. I have batteries, so I'm going to turn it on because I, I just can't contain my excitement. I have to do this right now. Be careful with knives. Don't do like I do and just flip it open next to you. Oh my goodness, this is a huge box. My husband does not know that I bought this for me and he doesn't know how much money I spent on it. He doesn't need to know. So y'all do me a favor and just don't tell him. One thing I've heard you need to look out for is does this shiny foil go all the way to the top of the tube? And in my case, it does. Yay, I got a good one, sweet, wow. Oh my God, they move, <gasps> the wings move, ah, I'm freaking out. Okay, that's so cool. All right, so it comes with the stand, obviously. They always come with stand. I'll set the stand to the side. This almost looks like something from Cardcaptor Sakura. Uh. I'm not reading any directions, I'm just kind of like figuring this out as I go. Okay, so there's the stand. It goes on there. It will go on there, up there, eventually. And this is the book, the book that tells you all the things in Japanese, because that's how they, how they go. Let's see. So it lights up. Awesome. You put the batteries in the back. It does not come with batteries. You turn it on in the back. I'll show you where that is. And then there's two buttons, like an A and a B button. And it looks like it does a crap load of sounds. You hit one and then hit two to go through the sounds, it looks like. And is that a button too? No, it just lights up. What's that bottom piece do? I don't know what that does. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, I'm figuring it out. It's always fun trying to decipher like how this stuff, oh. It came with English directions. Of course it did. I just wasted so much time looking at that manual in Japanese because I can't read Japanese yet. Okay, so we have the rod and the crystal that will light up. There's the number two operation button on the bottom right there. There is the mode select switch, which is twisting the knob. That's awkward. And then what does the top thing do? I don't know what that top one does. I'm, get, I'm just gonna have to figure it out. The four light and sound modes will change when spun. So we have moon gorgeous meditation, reenactment of the first appearance mode, moon gorgeous meditation without voice, and re reenactment of the first appearance mode without voice. And then there are one, two, three fade out and mode ends. So it looks like three options and then they fade out in the mode ends. Technique with voice, attack sound effect, voice and attack sound, okay. I think I understand what's going on here. I'm gonna turn this thing on because I've been waiting a very long time to be able to do this. I came prepared. If this thing doesn't work. Oh good, it works. Okay, I sure hope I bought the right kind of batteries. I just bought a slew of batteries because I knew I would need them eventually. Which way do they go in? Plus, I think they go that way. Where'd, this, where'd the thing go? There it is, the screwdriver. Okay, I still don't know what that does. It's so pretty! Look what I can do. Oh, dude, that's what it does. <laughs> I love it so much. Okay, I'm so happy that I finally got this thing. God, it's beautiful. Okay, I see, you know, honestly, I spent too much on this, but I feel like it was worth the money. It's quality. It's like hardcore quality. This is gorgeous. It's a gorgeous piece. It looks amazing, especially if you get the ones that have the sparkly 
fabric that goes all the way to the top and doesn't have that cut out at the very top, which apparently is a defect in some of them. Some of them. As far as the actual device goes, it looks like I got lucky and you're, you're done. Okay. And I don't see any, um, I don't see any printing errors or paint errors, which is good. So I think I got very lucky with mine and got a very good one, which I'm happy about since I spent money on it. Okay, so that is my Kaleida Moonscope Proplica and I'm very happy about it. And that was the blanket and the piece of jewelry. So yay, I had a very satisfying birthday. I'm very happy with what I got. And I think it was so perfect for my Sailor Moon fandom. And these are all things that I'm going to cherish for a very long time. Yay, so thank you to my imaginary best friend and my husband and myself <laughs> for the presents, the awesome. If you're interested in seeing more of the really cute little things that I have here, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Okay, I think that's about it for today. Um, don't forget to comment below and tell me what your favorite item from today was and if you have any questions about these items as well. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Sailor Snubs. I'll see you next time. Ciao.